Africa to solve this nice algebra problem, which is 8 to 1 raised to the power x, this is equal to x to the power 18. What is the value of x? Now, if you have a different technique of how to solve this algebra problem, kindly don't hesitate to show this in the comment section. Solution from here. Now, we have 81 raised to the power x. This is equal to x to the power 18. So the first thing here, let's eliminate this, the power of x here by multiplying both signs by 1 over x. Let's also multiply here by 1 over x. Now, 8 to 1 to power x times 1 over x, this is in the form of a to power n, this to power m, which we can express as a to power n times m. So applying this property, then we simplify x here. So this is 81, this is equal to x to power 18, this to power 1 over x. x to power 18, multiplying by 1 over x, this is in the form of a to power n, this to power m, which we can express as a to power m, this to power n. Applying this exponent property, then here we have 81, this is equal to x to power 1 over x, this to power 18. Now, you can see here, we have the base x here, and also we have, that is the reciprocal of the exponent, that is exponent x, it's the same here. So the next step is to eliminate this 18 by multiplying both signs by 1 over 18. Here, 1 over 18. So let's simplify here by 18, 1, by 18, 1. So this is the same thing as x to power 1 over x. This is equal to 81 raised to power 1 over 18. We can express 81 as 9 to power 2. So this implies that x to power 1 over x, this is the same thing as 9 to power 2 multiplied by 1 over 18. So here we have x to power 1 over x, this is equal to 9. Now here, let's simplify here, by 2, 1, by 2, this is 9. So 9 to power 1 over 9. So this implies that the base here is the same as, here, the, the base is the same as the exponent x here, and also the base here is the same as the exponent, which is 9. So this, this implies that if you have a raised to power 1 over n, this is equal to, essentially here, we have that the base is the same as the power here hex, and also we have the base here is equal to 9 here. So we have that given that a raised to power 1 over n, this is equal to b to power 1 over m. Then you find that here, we have that a is equal to b, and also we can equate 1 over n is equal to 1 over m. So applying this property, this implies that x is equal to 9. Now, this is by solving by using method 1. Let's apply method 2. Let's apply method 2. Now, in method 2 here, we have 81 raised to power x. This is equal to x to power 18. Now, 81 to power x, this is in the form of rog, a to power n, which we can express as n rog a. Applying this power root property of logarithm, then you find that we can express 81 to power x as rog 81 to power x. This is equal to rog x to 
power 18. Now applying this property, then we'll have that x log 81. This is equal to 18 log x. So the next step is to divide both signs here by x and also here by x. So x and x here simplifies. So here we have log 81. This is equal to 18 log x divided by x. The next step here, let's multiply both signs by 1 over 18 by 1 over 18. So that 18 here simplifies. So this implies we have log 81 over 18. This is equal to log x over x. Now, the next step here, we can express 81 as 9 to power 2. Substituting this, this implies here we have log 9 to power 2 over 18. This is equal to log x divided by x. So, log 9 to power 2, by applying the power rule property, that is log a to power n, this can be expressed as n log a. So let's apply this property. So now from here, we'll have 2 log 9 divided by 18. This is equal to log x divided by x. Now here we have 2 log 9 over 18. Let's simplify here by 2, 1, by 2, 9. So we have log 9 over 9. This is equal to log x over x. So here we have that log 9. This is equal to log x. And you can see here x is equal to 9. x is equal to 9. So by applying method 1 and method 2, whichever the case, we have that the value of x is equal to 9. So the next step here is to verify. Let's verify this value of x satisfies the equation. Now, if you recall here, we have that 81 raised to power x. This is equal to x to power 18. Substituting the value of x, we have 81 raised to power 9. This is equal to 9 to power 18. We can express 81 basically as, this can be expressed as 3 to power 4. So this implies that this is 3 to power 4 raised to power 9. This is equal to 9 to power 18. We can express 9 as 3 to power 2. So this is the same thing as 3 to power 2 raised to power 18. So 3 to power 4 raised to power 9 and 3 to power 2 raised to power 18. This is in the form of a to power n raised to power m, which we can express as a raised to power n times m. Applying this exponent property, then this follows that we have 3 to power 4 times 9. This is equal to 3 to power 2 times 18. So here we have 3 to power 4 times 9. This is 36, which is equal to 3 to power 18 times 2, which is 36. So this implies that the left add side is equal to the right add side and therefore this implies that the value of x which is equal to 9 this satisfies the equation so kind of refer the steps like this video and more importantly subscribe like and subscribe my good people see you in the next video